It's not what you're thinking. Well, I'm thinking that Bill thought he could kiss you because he could get away with it because you would let him. No. No, it wasn't about passion. It wasn't desire on oh, his part. Oh, okay, cool. Well, then it was just a few pecks on the cheek, right? Come on. Call them kisses of gratitude. Gratitude. That's new. He was feeling very vulnerable. Bill was feeling vulnerable. Yes, he was, because you were threatening to take his son away. No, I was not threatening to take his son away. I, no, I just wanted to have control over the situation so I could assuage my son's confusion and By disappointment. By getting sole custody of Will. How yes. do you think that made Bill feel? He felt like he was being stripped of his power, of his rights. I told him that I would talk to you. I also told him that he could step up and he could be the father that Will needs. Look, I know you didn't do it maliciously, Katie. No. I know you just wanted what was right for Will. But it didn't feel right to me. So I was there for Bill. I supported him, and he was grateful. He kissed me. Okay. Gratitude. That explains the first kiss. What about the second one? <sighs> uh, I think he just got caught up. In his gratitude. Well, and it's gratitude and some regret. Over losing you. He's been spiraling downward ever since we broke up. Chasing after Steffi and destroying his relationships with his sons. Including Will. Yes, including Will. He was thinking back about how it would be if we never split up. If we could have worked it out. And he was just thankful that I was there for him, that I was supporting him, defending him. So, he kissed me again. And that second kiss, Steffi saw. Oh, so that's why Ridge knows. Yeah, I know I should have told him myself. But I know how he gets when I bring up Bill. I was afraid he was going to go after him. And you and I both know that could lead to all kinds of trouble. 